Hi everyone. In this video I'm going to show how to control a servo motor using MPU6050 accelerometer sensor. If you're new to this channel please subscribe and turn on the bell button to get the notification of new videos. For this project, we need an Arduino Nano. MPU6050 accelerometer sensor. A servo motor. A breadboard. And some connectors. First, placing the Arduino in the breadboard. Then connecting Arduino 5 volt to breadboard positive terminal and ground with breadboard negative terminal. Then placing MPU6050 sensor in the breadboard. Connecting VCC with breadboard positive terminal and ground with breadboard negative terminal. Then connecting SD8 pin of MPU6050 with Arduino analog pin 4. An SCL pin of MPU6050 with Arduino analog pin 5. Now connecting servo motors positive with breadboard positive terminal and negative with breadboard negative terminal. Connecting servo motors PWM pin which is yellow with Arduino digital pin 9. Now coming in the coding part. First declared necessary libraries in this step. Creates an instance of the servo class to control a servo motor referred to as SG90. Specifies the pin to which the servo motor is connected. Creates an instance of the MPU6050 class to interact with the sensor. Declares variables to store the accelerometer readings along the X, Y, and Z axis. Declares variables to store the gyroscope readings along the X, Y, and Z axis. This is the setup function that initializes the servo. I2C communication serial communication, and the MPU6050 sensor. Attaches the servo motor to the specified pin. Now in the void loop function, first reads the accelerometer and gyroscope values from the sensor and stores them in the corresponding variables. Maps the accelerometer x-axis value from its range of minus 17,000 to 17,000 to a range of 0 to 180. This range is suitable for controlling the servo position. Sets the servo motor to the position corresponding to the mapped accelerometer x-axis value. Then upload the code. You see the servo motor's angle in the serial monitor. 